Yeah, man. Hello, my name is Miguel, and today I'm going to make for you Irish potato vegetable salad cube method. So you're going to need some Irish potato, about half a pound to quarter pound, some mixed vegetable, quarter cup, um, mayonnaise, butter, or you can use coconut oil, some salt, and boiled eggs, egg diced. So we're going to cube potato today. Alright, now put to heat a saucepan. Add enough water to boil the potatoes and just allow the water to get hot. But first we're going to boil the eggs. So just boil the egg until it's hard. Alright, just put the stove gauge on enough heat that it's covered at the bottom of the pot. That the flame is not going over the pot and it's on the bottom of the pot. About two or three medium and low. Alright, next put to eat a saucepan with enough water we're going to boil and allow the water to get hot. We're going we're gonna to prep the mixed vegetables next. You can use a canned mixed vegetable, just remove the water and rinse it. Alright, so you just after the water warm a little bit a couple seconds after you add the water you just add the mixed vegetable the frozen mixed vegetable. Cover the pot properly and allow. Alright, now we're going to prep slice while we wait for all of those to get ready you can wash the potato but you should wash the potato before you peel it but I didn't just peel it because I'm gonna rinse it when I'm finished alright peel it thin to the skin very thin and don't waste the potato, the Irish potato. When you go in the supermarket, pick firm Irish potato, not soft ones. They should be firm. And dent free. Alright, so slice and peel the Irish potato. Alright, boil the eggs. Took about eight minutes to get hard. Between eight, between eight to ten minutes. So you just start it off and remove the eggs. Don't let the eggs stay in the water and just allow it to cool. We're gonna shell it. So this is a um, mixed vegetable. This took seven minutes. So you just check to see how tender it is. You want to make sure the spring bean is not hard. Just bite in it. Once the spring bean is cooked, you finish. All right, it's finished. Just turn it off. Uh, let me show you. When you remove the water, all you have to do is just put out the knife close to the edge like this and remove the water. Or you can use a, a sieve and then just throw it in there and sieve it out. Alright, so that's it. Put it aside for later. Alright, now put to heat a saucepan with enough water. We're gonna boil the tea, the um, Irish potato. Just allow the water to get hot for a little while. And we'll put the stove gauge on six so the water can boil. Alright, Irish potato now. You just rinse it off after you peel it properly. 
rinse it off with fresh water all right so once you do that we're gonna dice it knife won't clean off from I was using it to peel so I gotta make sure it's clean properly alright so the best way put it on a flat surface like a chopping board And you just make cut the Irish potato in half, cut the half piece in half. Long way. And then cut cubes. Say about two to three inches. About this size. About one index, one bend of your finger. Alright, so you just do that for, for all the Irish potato. So you just, this is what you want. All right, now the water is boiling. It's been boiling for about you know, two, three minutes. It came to a boil. So you just add your dice, the cubed up Irish potato. Put the stove gauge on six, medium high and use the pot's lid and leave it slightly open like ah, halfway open. Irish potato been boiling for five minutes this is what it looks like just gonna give it a one stir see what your pot look like and then remember now leave it halfway open. if you don't it's gonna overflow and mess the pot up so it's been seven minutes That's it, it's finished, it's tenderized. Just turn it off. You can check it. No, I did I say 15 minutes? It's been 12 minutes for the Irish potato cubes. Take 12 minutes to cook the cubes. Alright, so you just remove the Irish potato and throw the water off. Alright, so this is what you want. Just add the butter. Let the butter melt with it and put it and allow it to cool. I just set this part in. And we add the butter. Allow it to melt. surf art surface and then remove the shell all right if you can get under the first little if you can get your finger under that thin film then you get a groove and then then it will be easier to take the shell off you gotta get under that little thin film alright like that all 
All right, now for Irish potato vegetable salad cube, you just add two tablespoons of mayonnaise, half a teaspoon of salt. It's the only time we had it salt. We didn't even boil it. We didn't add salt to the water or anything. That's the thing you gotta remember because you know, people add salt to the water, salt to every little thing. Add salt once. Alright, so you take your egg, cut it in half, and cube it. Note, you can remove the yolk and use just the white part only, or you can use both. I used both. I'm using both. Alright, so cut the egg, boiled egg, in cubes. If you don't want to use butter, I didn't remember if I said it earlier, but you can use coconut oil. So measure out a quarter cup of the mixed vegetable and then stir it in properly. And then you add the eggs, the boiled eggs. Alright, this salad is mainly like a meal there are some people that just love salad like this so it's served you can serve it now if you cooked it yourself or it can be served warm remember I said about the salt just add salt once and you can add some sprinkled you can sprinkle black pepper as well you can put it in the fridge and you serve it cool or you can serve it warm Irish potato vegetables salad the salad cube method alright let's let's sample this lunch potato salad with my Shark chicken breast tenders. Alright, 
so this is potato salad the lunch is really for lunch method and it's a hot 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 spicy uh, spicy jerk chicken spicy man goodness gracious it's spicy I personally, I personally declare jerk chicken the most, the best chicken meal in the world. And fried chicken, all right, still enough, but we get tired of fried chicken by now. Jerk chicken, all right. All right, see ya. Enjoy. Visit JamaicaDinners.com for the recipe. Subscribe, like, share, support. Bye. Yeah, man.